so Microsoft is coming out with their very own new Game Pass model, which is cheaper, but there's a catch. It's gonna support ads and uh, I don't know, man, this ad thing, I've always had a problem with ads, but let's see what they gotta talk about here. There's reports of this, let's check it out right now. Let's check this joint out. Microsoft could introduce a cheaper ad supported Game Pass tier survey suggests. Hmm, who would have thought? Okay, Microsoft could introduce a cheaper ad supported tier, a Game Pass Ultimate, according to a survey. The survey which appeared in Reset Era spotted Windows Central. Yes, people, Windows Central, supported by Microsoft. You guys know where Windows Central is. It appears to have whether players be willing to pay lower amounts that to a standard Xbox Game Pass monthly fee in exchange for limitations on the subscription. Hmm, that's kinda that's kinda weird for me. One option will see players pay a lower fee but have access to first party Xbox titles on a delay, which could be a much better offer than six months. A reduced tier that also see integrated ads as a part of the service. However, it's not clear how these ads would manifest. While a survey in a non in, in non addiction? Well, that's weird. That indication, oh wow, that's weird. Of something guaranteed to happen, it does suggest Microsoft is looking for ways to expand its Game Pass subscription base, which is Xbox Phil Spencer to admit a slowdown on the console despite strong adoption. Because if you guys remember, there was a major reports of saying they didn't hit their sales projections. I didn't record report on it because you know there's always people I was like, you know, I don't care about that. You know, it is what it is, even though I'm a new source now. But yeah, that's kind of mm. as of January 2022, Game Pass has over 25 million subscribers, according to Microsoft. The company recently claimed as a part of the UK investigation into its proposed Activision acquisition that it has installed base of 63 million consoles, which is good, but it's not as much as we want. Speaking during a web call earlier this year transcribed by VGC, Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella stated that Game Pass uses growth across all platforms driven by a strength of a console. He said PC Game Pass subscriptions increased 159% year over year. And with cloud gaming, we're transforming how games are distribution and played well. More than 20 million people have used the service to stream games to date. It was reported earlier this month that service guaranteed or generated around 2.9 billion in revenue just on console in 2021. So what the main gist of this thing is, there's a survey going around, this is just a summary. There's a summary going around that suggests that Microsoft will be having a low tier Game Pass right now. Game Pass is $10.999 or Game Pass Ultimate $14.99 a month. But a, a lower tier Game Pass will probably be $4.99 or $5. Cut that one in half, but you get ads. How will the ads suffice in the game? So maybe you get like a, maybe they can do like twitch have a thing pop up on the bottom of hell i even i would do that pop up give me a freaking ad for cheaper game pass you know what i mean they'd be kind of cool but if it stops the game like the third party apps stuff like that you stop the whole game and oh 15 20 seconds to add it'll be you know just oh you have mcdonald's i'm sitting there playing call of duty and a fucking mcdonald's ad pops up or a raceway or something pops up or, or g fuel see g fuel pop up on there man that'd be crazy but you know Oh, yeah, you like the hat, guys? Yeah, new Constellation hat, Bethesda. Let's go, people. Yeah, Starfield all day. Anyway, we're not tired here to talk about that. We're here to talk about this Game Pass. I still think a cheaper option for Game Pass is fine. Yes, it is fine, but it does run ads. Just think if it's a game, if you see a little ticker on the bottom side of the game, something like that. I don't know. They can implement it because... You know what they want to do is have people step into the forefront game pass is what they really want to do man software over hardware right now they don't have the games right now but pretty soon they're gonna have their games which is 2023 this is the year of xbox and the year of announcements and if and for the next video i'm gonna talk about is potential showcase but overall i want to say this is an all right idea if you guys like ads anything you do right now there's always ads if they do the thing what twitch does have the ad at the bottom of the screen stop the thing for ads or you know, it is what it is, man. But as long as there is like a guarantee interval for it, I don't see a problem with it, but it is what it is, man. Xbox, I, I, I don't know, man. It's like, what can you do, man? If you don't pay that much, you gotta suffer with ads, but that's the game we play now. All right, y'all, like, share, subscribe, peace. Stay tuned for some more anime and gaming content.